I was going to take a minute to record in here, but uh, they're all nursing so much. This is just a micro. I'm not doing a real close-up yet, but I didn't, didn't want all this to go to waste. Oh, hi. Okay, me too. You guys notice that they they always nurse in the same order because they've all got their spots that they've picked and they always want to go back to the same spot. It's always. just sitting here waiting for them to finish nursing so they'll be tired out. How many eyes we've got while we're sitting here? I mean, from the ones that are coming off. Did you open yet, buddy? I thought for sure you'd be open today. Hi. Oh, you're not going to show me if you are. You aren't, though. Wow, you feel a little extra fuzzy today. If I were to switch Friday and Monday, they would go back before they started nursing. They're, they look so much like they're open, but then you look up close and you're like, ah, it's just a shadow. He's trying to nurse on mom's paw now. All right, this is just a micro, this version, um, but I thought um, because the weights were a little off, we were going to recheck, although I don't think they're off. So I just uh, I had uh, one of the admins uh, said, all the weights seem a little off today. Um, maybe it's because the sofa was on there. What I think we're seeing is uh, DJ and I weighed them pretty late last night, and uh it's not unusual for them to eat less at night. So those numbers average out when the, the weights are taken further apart. But uh, it's, I don't think that their weights would be unusual for having been weighed just, you know, a few hours later at, at, at the overnight time. It's not, it's not unusual. So let's just verify though. So it's a different recheck. So 8.7 uh, for a noisy little kid. I know, I know, I know. All right. I don't actually have the weights in front of me, so I don't know what they are, but we'll just reweigh everybody real, real quick. And I'll get right back to the food again. That's probably why they're so hungry right now, because they probably didn't get a chance to eat much with mom overnight. So Greg's 9.1. Uh, Holly is 8.6. Okay, I'm going to try not to miss anybody. Monday is the big one. Yeah, you don't even need to be big. I guess you got a lot to feed there. Okay, 9.3. Okay, hang on. Real quick, pal. I know you definitely get right back to it. You've always been in the last place. You got catch up, pal? Are you more catch up? 7.7. .7. Oh, and noisy. Okay, get back in there. And, oh, you too, pal. It's a cute Friday. 8.34, uh, okay, in the neighborhood. I'm guessing those are all the same numbers. Uh, and like I said, I, I'm not worried about it yet because that weight came, uh, the measurement came so soon after the last one. So it may look like it's off trend, but my guess is that uh, the next weigh-in will show that that was just because 
they didn't eat much overnight and that's fine it happens all the time On the other hand, if the next one is still low, uh, we'll do some supplemental feedings. But all these kids have enough uh, of a buffer on them now that I'm not worried about it. We've had we've had much skinnier kittens before we've been concerned. So these guys all have a little bit of the baby fat going on, just the way we like it. Get in there, though. You, it's the smallest kid. Even if you got the same amount of fat, you've got to catch up, pal. You've got to feed that growth. Okay, just double checking.